No, I mean, that's a beautiful thing right there. But, I mean, when it comes to this music industry, though, Erica, mm -hmm. was it everything that you expected it to be when you got into the game? Mm -hmm. Or did it turn out to be a little bit more wilder and crazier? Um, You know what? It kind of was everything I expected it to be. Mm -hmm. um, because I knew coming into it, I knew that... It's not a world where you're going to make friends. Mm. Nobody's your friend. Yep. We're all competitors, you know. And, um, yeah, it's kind of like a, a friendly competition of a world, you mm -hmm. know, with anything you do. Yeah. And, um, you know, once you look at it like that and you look at it like these people are not my friends, but these people are my colleagues, yeah. then you'll be all right. But if you go into this, this world thinking that, oh, my God, everybody loves me and everybody's my friend because I'm so good at what I do. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're in for a rude awakening. These yeah. people hate you. <laughs> you know, <laughs> for real. like literally. But everybody goes around and, hey, how you doing? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You got to still politic. Like, yeah. So if you know how to politic, you're going to be all right. So far, what has been your best time in the game, though, Erica? Out of all of these shows, television, mm -hmm. touring, studio sessions, yeah, what has stuck out to you? That chick. Ooh. Uh, yep. When that the chick. chick hit, talk to me about the chick then. <laughs> yeah. Shoot. That chick, whether yeah. it be from a feature, whether it be from a booking, uh, whether it be from merch, uh, an episode on TV, mm. uh, anything. Mm -hmm. Like, that's probably been... The biggest change in my life is mm. the the type of money that I make. Yeah. You know, because before this, I was working at um this store called Agassi. Mm. It's similar to like a Forever Twenty One. Okay. Yeah, it was at the mall in Texas where I was living at the time, and you know, at that time I was making like like eight dollars an hour. Mm. You know, and I was working like twenty hours a week. Mm. You know, and Ooh. now I'm I'm blessed. You, you know, did, right? So, you, right. Hey. you know what? That's a good good point though, because coming from that. You know, you living your life, you still having fun. You ain't right, right, right. I was, I was like living that. a great life yeah, now. Yeah. yeah, so you feel like that. But going from that to where you're at now, did you have like financial advice or your parents Ooh. or anybody to like help guide you? Because a lot of people get that, blow it, don't know how to invest, don't know how to move to the next level, and now yeah. they're just broke, but they look like they popping. Right. So with that, my mom, she just stood real heavy, like. <laughs> on not spending my money all at one time. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, of course, being a mom, she gonna be like, hey girl, like you need to learn how to manage your money. Like yeah. this is not gonna be your career forever. Mm. I'm like, yeah, mama, but I ain't never had this, so I'm gonna blow it real fast <laughs> and I'm gonna just make yeah. it back, yeah. you know? But I mean, you know, we all do that. Like I blew out every money I got in the first year in 2020 and luckily I was able to make it all back, mm -hmm. you know? So I feel like you ain't really a hustler if you can't lose it all and make it back. What were the first things you were spending that money on? Um. <laughs> What's the first, first, first thing I bought? And then oh. you still have it. I do. Okay. I do. I went to the Louis Vuitton. I mean, yeah, Louis Vuitton store, and I bought like six bags. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm I, mad at that because that's yeah, that's not my man. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I, I bought like six bags and shit. After that, I went and bought me a Benz. Mm -hmm. Um, and then a year later, I got my body done. Mm -hmm. And then a year after that, I got my teeth done. Mm. And then I got my body done again. <laughs> and um, yeah, I just. I mean, now I don't just blow money like that anymore. Yeah. I've learned how to manage it over the four years. Yeah. But, yeah, the first thing, the first couple of things I bought was the car, the bags, and the body. That's mm. the first thing I got, too, was the Benz. Be how no. For real? I was in my car. Hello? I pulled up like, <laughs> beep, beep. Okay. <laughs> I'm inside you. <laughs> That's the first thing I got, too, so I ain't even mad at it. But speaking of that, so, I mean, because that don't really even seem like you went too crazy. But No, I really didn't. Yeah, speaking of that, I know on Trending Topics, Dream Doll just um, said yesterday, or it just dropped yesterday, mm -hmm. that she's wanting to transition back, um, I guess, skinny's in. You know, I don't know. Right, she wants so, to transition to back to her normal body, yeah. I think she said something mm -hmm. like that. So would you ever even consider that? Because I know you just recently got the second round, right? Like the end of last year, yeah. The end of last year. Okay, yeah. so would you ever think about doing that or be like, girl, no? Girl, I'll pay for this. Girl, I'll pay for this. Yeah. <laughs> girl, I'm pay too much for this. <laughs> but I mean, like, honestly, I'm really happy with it, mm -hmm. you know? So I wouldn't I wouldn't go back and, and get a reduction. However, I was getting my makeup done earlier and my makeup artist was like, girl, what you gonna do when you get older and you be wide as fuck? <laughs> kids, I probably am going to be wild as a train, but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. You know, you have to just, you know, when we get there, we'll see. I'll see. <laughs> I'm not there yet. Yes. That's far, far away, y'all. Yeah, I'll, yeah. I'll worry about it then. If, the, if my doctor's still doing surgeries, I'll probably go back then, but right now, I'm good. Yeah, I, look, I feel it. And let me ask you, do you work out and stuff? Because they say, like, 
you have to keep it up. Is it hard yeah. maintaining? Girl, I worked there for like the first three months, and then I just stopped. It, 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 it is what it is. <laughs> 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 I'm about to give me some old dip girl. Girl, I eat Church's Chicken every other day. Then, I love Church's Chicken. Where you get that? You in Atlanta, right? They got Church's Chicken out here. Great, yeah, far as hell. I you know, know far. Okay, okay. It's I like over it that bad. It's a road too. It ain't Cal- that yeah, far. Yeah, they yeah, got yeah, Church's yeah. Chicken over there. Yeah, we got some churches now. Yeah, so if I don't do that, I'm gonna. <laughs> what happened? Did it hurt when you did it, and did it scare you that you might have died when you got your body done? Okay, so I ain't gonna lie. I did watch like numerous videos of yeah. women getting a surgery before I did it because I wanted to see what they. I mean, you know what they gonna do to me? Yeah. yeah. And when I saw, have y'all ever seen it? I have. I seen the. Uh, well, I seen the lipo. I haven't seen like the full everything because right. I was about But you saw the lipo part, mm-hmm. right? Did it scare you? I'm not going to lie, the weight I've gained right now, I was past the scare. I'm like, sign me up. <laughs> That's how I was. I'm like, shit, did this time I'm look out Look, yeah. Take me yeah. in. Can't lie to you. I was like, baby, go ahead. Child, I just, you know, I was scared, but I just said a prayer. Yeah. And I just went in there and was like, I'm giving it to God. How's mm-hmm. the recovery? And how Ooh. long do it take to recover? Because so um, how does that impact the business when you over here recovering and how long? Right. Okay, so see what I did was I did all of my content and stuff before I went into surgery. Smart. That's right. Yeah. So That's when right. I was in the bed for like 30 days and I couldn't do anything, I was yeah. just posting every day because I already had my content already done. Yeah, yeah. Um, but the healing process and going through it, you know, like the first day until you're healed is hell. Um mm. Probably the worst pain I've ever experienced in my whole life. What? Yeah, like the first day, um, because my mom took care of me. She did the aftercare. Yeah. The first day, um, I passed out. What? Um, yes, when I when I got back to the Airbnb, um, I was really hot, and you know you lose a lot of blood. Yeah. yeah. You know, so I passed out the first day. It was so scary, um, and then the pain is just excruciating. You know, because mm. the inside of your body is like. Yeah. Brutalized. Like what the right. hell's going on? Like what the hell's going yeah. on? You yeah. know what I'm saying? So it, it took a while. I probably didn't stop hurting all the way until like April. I got my surgery in December. Oh yeah. wow! I just stopped hurting in like April. And let me ask you, cause you got a big old booty, girl. Is it that big, Ari, y'all? It, it's no, it ain't like crazy. But I know <laughs> Ari was saying that you know, cause she got a big booty too. She right. was like her back be hurting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because of like her butt is so heavy when she sleeps. Like, do you have those pains and stuff too? You know, I don't have back pains just yet. Okay. Maybe. Oh, excuse me. Maybe after I had them kids, I might start having back pains. Mm-hmm. But right now, it's kind of cool. Yeah. Now it do feel heavy. But like it don't hurt my back yet. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So yeah. She was like, she can't even sleep a certain type of way because her back be hurting, whatever. Oh no, girl, I yeah. sleeps. Yeah. Yeah. I be <laughs> 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 knocked out. <laughs> what do you do when these men are going crazy as hell and stalking you every five minutes? How do you mm. deal with that attention? Um, I ask them how much money they got. And then if they don't got the right answer, I'd be like, okay, well, that's the end of that conversation. And they actually do get the hell on because they respect it. So but, what about the one that's like, diamond, diamond, I come and watch you every weekend. And I'll be like, and I love you for that, baby, but that's, that's we can't get no further than that. <laughs> this man, I think he's playing. He is crazy. <laughs> it, it's not so much I can do with you, baby. Like, what are we going to do? But-